Hi, my name's Kim Turner, and I was just doing some research on Google, and I came across your website. I don't want to take up too much of your time today, but I, I really think your site's got some potential. So I, I thought I'd make you a really short video and give you some pointers on how to get your site listed on the top of Google. Let me show you something. I don't know if you're aware, but this is one of your top competitors. They're already on the first page of Google, and they're getting all kinds of business from it. Being on the first page of Google comes with some huge benefits. Take a look at this pie chart provided by Google. Now, most people already know that getting on the first page of Google will get them more calls. But check this out. See this area here in blue? That says that over 42% of all the clicks on the first page goes to the top spot. That's 42%. Now, I'm not talking about the paid advertisements, but the actual top organic spot. This red piece shows that about 12% is going to the second spot, and the third spot only gets around 8.5%. As you can see, it starts to really drop off from there. So just being on the first page is not enough. You really need to dominate it. Now, I also took a minute to pull up some of the best keywords for you. These are the words or phrases that people type into Google or the other search engines when they're searching for something, for a product or a service. I don't know if you know this already, but this is the number one mistake that most business owners make. They simply don't spend enough time doing proper keyword research. If you look here at the keywords that I found for you, you'll notice two things. One, they're local keywords targeting your type of business. But the main thing is they are buyer keywords. It's very important to target keywords that are searched for by people who are actually looking to buy your product, not those just doing research. Now the internet's full of people just looking for information. And of course, this differentiation can make a huge difference to how successful you are. Now, I have a free tool on my own website that will give you a better idea of just how much work your site really needs. It's called a Website Grader. Please feel free to check it out for yourself. Now, what it does is create a three-page report with all of the errors that it finds on your site. If you want to read all of the errors that I found on your site, as I said, feel free to go and run the report. My website address is famous performance marketing.com forward slash website grader. Now there's a lot of information on the first page, but the main thing I want to point out here is your score. This grader issues scores that range from zero all the way up to 100. The better your site is set up, the higher your score will be. And as you can see by your score, there's a lot of room for improvement. Now, my report will also tell you the number of backlinks to your site. I can see that your site can definitely use more backlinks. Now, without going into too much uh, boring detail, Google looks at backlinks as though they are a referral to your business. So naturally, you want lots of them. Simply, the more sites that send a link back to your site, the higher you'll show up on Google. Now again, there's lots of other uh, pieces of useful information in this report, so please make sure you go and check it out. Last of all, I want to talk to you a little bit about marketing and conversions. Now obviously it's extremely important to get visitors to your website, but when they get to your site, you then need to consider how many conversions you get from those visitors. Basically, how many of those visitors either fills out a form or calls you or takes whatever action that you want them to. Now there are plenty of free tools like Google Analytics that will track these things. But I noticed a few problems with your site that you really should address. Here's a sample website that I made for demonstration purposes. As you can see, it's a reasonably attractive site without being too fancy. Not fancy or complicated is what we want. You don't want a lot of distraction taking away from what's important. And what's important is to get the people to call you or to fill out your contact form, or as I said, to take the action that you want. As you can see here, right on the top I have my client's phone number and a call to action. 
This way, people don't have to search around for information when they come to my sites because the information they came for is clearly visible. It's obvious. Next, I want you to have a look over to the right. Do you see that free report form? This is key. This is a very effective way for you to build trust with people. Providing free and valuable information allows people to begin to know you and to know your expertise. And it can be the link which gets them to take the concrete action of actually using your services. You need this on every page. Why? Because you never know what page your clients will land on. So if you have that form on every page, then you dramatically increase your chance of building trust with your visitors and them selecting you instead of someone else. Also, make sure this information is above the fold, which means they don't have to scroll down to see it. That way, when they land on your site, it's in their face. Okay, so as a quick recap, you really need three things to get your site on the top of Google. Number one, good keywords. Two, with good keywords, you'll need some well-written content that uses those keywords, but doesn't overuse them. A good ratio is 2 to 4 percent. And three, you need to get lots of relevant backlinks. The best links come from websites that are about the same things your site is about and are in your city or state. And last but certainly not least, you need a high converting website that forces visitors to take action or take the actions that you want them to take. I hope I was able to give you some good information today. I know it's a lot to soak in. Search engine optimization, or as it's abbreviated, SEO, simply means getting your website ranked on the first page of Google or the other search engines, and preferably in the top three. I know it can be a bit overwhelming sometimes, but it's very rewarding. Please feel free to give me a call if you need help or have any questions. I'll, I'll certainly be happy to help you out. Here's my contact information. I'd love to catch up with you, and I'll talk to you soon.